My name is Reese Jacobs. I am the uh, assistant principal here at East Paulding, and I, this is my sixth year um, as assistant principal here. We started our PBIS implementation um, several years ago. Um, you know, we went through different trainings. We had, you know, our committee that came up with, and initially was doing great. Um, we saw a big uh, drop in behavior, and then all of a sudden, we kind of plateaued. When Classcraft was introduced to us, I'm actually on the PBIS committee here at the school, and we were trying to find something that would work. We had a sixth grade team um, that has been using Classcraft on their own and introduced this idea to us, and I was like, I don't know. I'm not a video gamer, I don't get it. And I was very against this. I was like, this is one more thing on my plate that I have to do. But once I sat down with another teacher in my building who's used it, and he said, this is really not that hard. Let's wrap our head around how to make this work. Um, he sat down with me for 10 minutes and showed me how to do this. And I was like, okay, I'll roll it out to the kids. We'll see what happens. I had kids who I had not seen any sort of engagement light up because this is their world. It was definitely something I was not on board with initially, but I've seen the benefit of Classcraft. Um, I've seen kids who didn't care about their behavior change their behavior because they know if they do X, Y, and Z, they get this many points for this, that, and the other. Um, and it's teaching them to be responsible, I think, which is really my goal. To me, I think it's probably a, a way to connect kids to learning. Because like I said, if I'm a gamer and I realize that I can benefit in the class craft game because of w the way I'm behaving or completing my assignments or d whatever it is that I'm doing in school, then that's going to connect me to learning. If I'm not a gamer but I'm a kid who's, I got a lot going on and I just need a homework pass or something like that, there's an opportunity for me. So to me it's, it's, a, it's a way to connect kids to engagement. We have seen a decrease uh, in referrals since we've implemented class craft. First month we saw a over a 20 percent decrease in referrals uh, as we moved into October, we saw um, an even greater than 20% decrease, almost 25% decrease in referrals. Um, in November, we saw um, an additional almost 20%, 19.7% uh, um, drop in referrals um, from one year to the next with the only major change that we did was the implementation of Classcraft as our vehicle for our PBIS system. I think the, the the metrics that and the data that Classcraft gives, I mean we we we're, we're in a we're in a time of data. I mean we have, you know, data on on everything. So much data we we can't you know even look at all of it all the time. But Classcraft gives it to us in a very succinct manner, uh, a very user friendly manner. But it's also very valid. I mean we we use it to uh, show our students of the month every month. It's very simple. It takes me 10 minutes to go through and say, okay, for from this date to this date, who has had the most XP given in each grade? Boom, we've got it. And that's, that's how we know our, who our students of the month are. You know, if there's a particular kid that's been struggling, um, we can go on and say, oh, well, yeah, I can see here, you know, he's, he's not earning a lot of points. You know, he has had a lot of HP taken. Um, you know, maybe we need to, you know, sit down and talk to those teachers, figure out, you know, what, what's the change? Um, we can see change over time. You know, we can say, oh, this, you know, three months ago, this kid was one of the top earners and now he's really struggling. You know, what has changed? And it just gives us another tool to, to help a kid. If, you know, mom and dad, the school, the community, if we're all on the same page and we're building those kids up, then you just have happy kids that are just happy to be happy, not happy because they're getting something or they've earned something. They're just happy because they know people care.